Hey guys, it's JD from Ponzo World, and today we are unboxing and reviewing these $60 earbuds made by Sandu. Now in this case, you can find these on Amazon. Uh, they're water resistant, of course they're wireless, as I said, and uh, they have this really unique look to them. And as usual, in this video, we're gonna be unboxing and reviewing them and finding out if they're worth the $56 price point that they are on Amazon. So, uh, not much more to say about it, so let's go ahead and take a look around the box. First of all, we have this nice little baggie over it, so I'm just going to rip that off right now. So we can get a better look at the box. Here we are. There's some um, features on the back. Bluetooth uh, 5.0, so that's pretty new. Um, water resistance, stuff like that. There's the label if you want to look at that. And then on the front, Sandu, we have a nice little, uh, I guess, a diagram or picture of what they look like. True wireless earbuds. Immediately feedback. Okay, so I guess if you want to uh, ask them questions or something like that or give feedback, there's a uh, contact info. And uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and just get into these. So let's cut here. And then see how these come out. There we go. They're in there pretty firm. Come on. Boy. There we go. That took a lot of effort. Uh, here we are. This is a quick quick start guide. So this tells you how to charge, pair, and uh, the different earbud fittings, I guess you could call them. So then they fit to your ear. And uh, pull up this. And uh, here they are. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Set that off to the side. And let's pull out this little accessory box here. Let's see here, where do I open this? Right here. Let's see what's inside of here. We have, okay, so a pretty nice little carrying case here. A little baggie. Pull that open, see what's inside of here. We have your charging cord, which is micro USB. Pretty flimsy little cable though. Not very thick, so that's pretty good. Bend all around. <laughs> Set that off to the side. See what else is in here. We have, okay, your little bag of uh, the little earpiece fitting so that it fits your ear. Set that off to the side too. Put all this over here. See what's inside of here. Happy, or is it gonna say not happy? Unhappy, okay. <laughs> See what's inside of here. Okay, it tells you how to contact them. Set that off to the side, and then here we have a, yeah, basically a instruction booklet. So uh, that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and pop these open. There we go, nice little click. And uh, okay, so I'm gonna have to, or no? Okay, they already come with charge, so that's good. Let's put those in and out so then they can both charge up. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and test these out in a minute. So uh, I'll be back with you guys in a few minutes. All right, so I went ahead and just tested these out. And uh, they do sound pretty decent. Let me go ahead and turn them up all the way. You can see they are quite loud. Uh, they do have a pretty decent amount of bass too. Sound quality is pretty good. Uh, when I turned it up, by the way, there's no distortion whatsoever. And um, they sound pretty decent overall. Now, uh, one thing I do like is, let's go ahead and show you here. You can see it's playing right there. And if we click this little button on here, I'll do that right now. You can see it paused. And now if I hold down uh, on either side one of the buttons, You can see there, when I let go, it brought up Siri. So that's pretty cool too. Um, and then of course these have a built-in uh, microphone so you could talk through these instead of the phone. Um, and I'm just gonna show you around the earbud here. So here you have your ear t earpiece thing that goes into your ear. You have a little hook. There's your uh, wireless connections there. 
and then we have sand dew on the side and then a pretty big uh enclo well i don't care about we'll focus there we go enclosure for the uh the little speaker inside it's pretty decently uh, big too um not overly big of course and of course it also holds the battery stuff like that you can see there there is an led inside so whenever it blinks you know it's on or whenever it's charging it shows a little red light and i'll just show that now let's go ahead and pop these in hold on which side is this okay there we go yeah it kind of clicks in there when you get it right you can see there they are charging let's close this up and there we go red red so right now you know they're charging and um you could kind of see the yeah, you can kind of see the LEDs in there for the actual uh, battery percentage of the box itself. And then you can see they're blue. Right now they're trying to pair to my phone. And uh, yeah, so these are pretty cool overall. What I am going to do now is uh, go ahead and dip these in some water because, of course, they all are uh, water resistant, wet resistant, whatever you want to call it. And uh, I'm going to dip them in there, take them out, and then uh, dry them off and see if they still work. All right, so as you can tell, I have a pretty shallow uh, puddle of water in our downstairs sink. What I'm now going to do is get both of these. They are, they are on because they're out of the case. Let's go ahead and toss them in there. Any air bubbles? Not so far, so that's pretty good. You can see they are still on. Let's go ahead and leave them there for just a few more seconds. And then I'll, uh, well, actually, you know what? I'm just gonna increase the water depth. There you go. Now they're completely underwater. And uh, I don't see any air bubbles coming out, so that's good. That means no water's getting in or no air's escaping. So uh, let's go and leave, leave them in there for a few more seconds and then I'll uh, see if they still. All right, so it's a few minutes later. I went ahead and dried these off and uh, let's go ahead and put them in on camera and see if they sound the same. Let's click play. Okay. Yep, they sound the exact same. So uh, that's pretty good. They uh, survived the water test. And uh, let's go in and see if I put them in this case. Now the case is not water resistant. So if you put these through the wash or something, uh, this case might be fried, but the earbuds will survive perfectly fine. So let's go ahead and see here. This is the left one. Let's put that one in, and when you put them in the case, they immediately turn off on their own. Close up the case, and sure enough, they're both charging. You can see their red LEDs are on. So that's pretty good. They survived the water test perfectly fine. And uh, yeah, so not much more to say about them. So let's go ahead and stop the clip and i'll give you guys my final opinion all right so what do i think of these sandu wireless earbuds i think they're pretty good uh are they worth 50 dollars though yeah they're probably worth just about 50 dollars uh i mean they sound like 50 dollar wireless earbuds uh that they, they seem to be pretty water resistant and um overall these are pretty good so i do recommend them um you probably won't find anything better for $55, that might be wrong there. There might be ones out there for 30, that might be better. But um, overall, I don't think you're gonna be overspending, um, but I also don't think it's too cheap of a price point either. Um, but overall, I am pretty happy with these. I do recommend them if you're looking for a pretty good pair of uh, wireless, water, re water resistant, waterproof uh, earbuds that are of course pretty much completely wireless except for charging the case itself. So, um, yeah, I hope everybody enjoyed this video. Let's go ahead and put these in once more. And, um, oh, wait, one thing. I almost forgot. Uh, build quality on these. Uh, build quality on the actual headphones or earbuds, whatever you want to call them, are pretty good. Uh, they aren't light, but they are, are definitely not heavy either. Uh, they feel probably about the same weight of, uh, Apple AirPods. They're not, they're not going to be falling out randomly or anything. Um, so that's pretty good for the case, uh, isn't the greatest material, but it is plastic and I'm sure if you drop it, you know, it isn't just gonna crack or stuff like that. 
Um, but the case does overall feel pretty decent in the hand, although it is just basically pure plastic. So, uh, yeah, I guess that's it for this video. I hope everybody enjoyed, and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye.